Hi guys, I thought I'd make you a quick video about limiting beliefs. So first of all, who am I? Emily, my name's Emily Fisher. So what is a limiting belief? A limiting belief is something that tells you that you can't have something else. So for example, what can I give you for an example? I can't, I don't want to say anything because I don't want to like wish it into reality. So I was going to make one up. Um, let me think about one I used to have. I can't own my own house because I don't make enough money. <laughs> That's silly. So the thing is, once you identify the limiting belief, and normally you can identify about 80, maybe even up to 90% of your limiting beliefs when the other 10% 10, 10 are usually a blind spot that you can't see. So you usually need some outside person to show you that 10 to 20%. But in the meantime, the 80%, which is the most important right now, how do you identify those? Those are the reoccurring thoughts, the things that tell you that you can't have X. You can't have X and then you state why. Why can't you have X? This was an old one that I used to have. I can't have my own house because I don't make enough money or because I don't know how to go to the bank or because I don't know. And you just write down all the reasons why you, um, you think you can't have it. And then what you need to do is go and say, is this true? <laughs> is it true that I don't make enough money? Well, no, I think it's true. That's why it's still a limiting belief. But if I went on and saw the calculator, um, that like if you go on the mortgage company and then you write in and then you're like, oh, well, it's only $900 a month to have, and you're probably paying more than that in rent. So then maybe your next one comes up. So you prove that one wrong. You can have, you do make enough money. Or if you don't, you effing go figure out how to make enough money, which is totally possible. And if you're in my money mastermind, I show you how to make money quickly, super rapidly quickly, like insanely quickly. So there, you eliminated that one. So what's the next one? What's the next limiting belief? My credit's not good. Okay, most of you don't even know what your credit is. And there's private lenders that will lend to people that don't have good credit or perfect credit. And then basically you have to prove that one wrong as well. You prove it wrong. So then you go figure out what is your friggin' credit. You figure it out. Okay, it's not very good. Guess guess what? You can improve your credit in three months following. Most of you don't, we're not taught how to improve our credit or what credit is, or like a lot of people have this thing around, they don't even know what it is. So they just like sweep it under the rug and they're like, I, I don't know. You don't know, okay? If you don't know, you don't know, right? So then you go figure it out. You just keep eliminating these things that say you can't have the thing that you want and you might not get it right away, but as soon as you eliminate, or uh, sorry, as soon as you, uh, identify the limiting belief and then you start figuring out the reasons why you think you can't have it and then you start squishing them so it actually has to be put into some type of system I'm able to do it most of the time rapidly very quickly in my head but if I want a bigger goal now I actually have to write it down and there is an actual system that will get you the things that you want so I have 25 big goals a year and I just redid my goals recently and I've already reached two of those 25 goals within less than three weeks following the system that I teach in the Money Mastermind. So definitely reach out because one of their main objects objections is coming overcoming limiting beliefs and you can definitely go do it on your own but when you have a proven system that works 
and you also are in a group of people that keep you accountable, it's much, much easier. And when you have the proper system, it's easier to quickly, quickly, quickly obtain the goals that you want to reach. So I hope you found this video of value. If you did, please share it and check out the Money Mastermind. I actually need to make a sales page for the Money Mastermind so people can just click and purchase. I only actually have five spots left. It's only offered to a small, small amount of people. So the intake is right now. If you have any other questions, please reach out and get a hold of me because I can help you get the things you want and make more money. Money is not a bad thing. Money is a good thing. Money fuels you to get the things you want. Will money make you happy? I, I believe deep in my every cell of my body that having more money and doing the right things with it does make you happier. You weren't born to suffer. So if you have something around you suffering right now, and you must have something around thinking that money is bad and it is not bad it's good and if you use it for good it's even better so take care reach out thanks for watching if you feel called to please share this video and i'll talk to you soon bye guys